Hello, I'm Mike Russell from musicradiocreative.com. In this video, let's look at how to remove vocals from a song in Audacity. If you're creating an online radio show, podcast, radio imaging, or simply want to make your voice sound different, you must get hold of my Audacity presets. Head over to mrc.fm forward slash presets. Go and get them now at mrc.fm forward slash presets. Check the mic and make sure it sound right, boy. It sound right, boy. Now, there are many ways you can do this and many settings in this effect. So let's dive in and find out more. Uh, first of all, you get a song, or in this case, I've got a jingle of ours. Let's play it. It's Okay, so that sounds great, but we want to pull the vocals out and focus on having the music, kind of like a karaoke track, if you like. Uh, so it's available to you to use in the effect menu, and it's an effect called Vocal Reduction and Isolation. Okay, now this works pretty well, but not always as well as you think. So let's try the remove vocals, which would seem logical. It's and to me, I don't know about you, it feels like it's isolated the vocals rather than removed them. So not always great. Now we can play with some of these settings here, but let's first of all go through a few more. First of all, you've got something like, uh, well, you can remove the center. So let's do that and play. And actually, again, it's further isolated the vocals and removed some of those central instruments. So pretty interesting effect. Great if you're isolating vocals, but we're trying to remove them. So let's go for isolate the center and see whether this will help remove vocals. Let's play. Much better, much better. Now we're left with a kind of music bed and most of the vocals have gone. It's not completely clean, not everything, but we've done a lot there. So sometimes it's a case of trying these different actions available in this preset, and it's not always the most logical. It's not always remove vocals. Yes, if you have vocals perfectly in the center and all your instruments are out in the stereo field, probably remove vocals will do a great job. But in this case, I needed to isolate center. So let's now have a play uh, with this, and let's maybe move this high and low cut around and play. And we might move that high cut up a bit more to try and cut off for more of the vocals. And then we can move the strength up ever so slightly and see what we get. And we're getting pretty good there. We can click OK. It's made the track quite quiet, though, so we might have to go now into Effect and Normalize. Again, up to minus 1 dB to make it louder. And there we go. We've got something that works pretty much as a music bed now, though as opposed to having those vocals front and center. And it's done a pretty good job. So if you want to create a karaoke track or remove vocals, that is your go-to effect inside Audacity. There are other plugins and apps and things that can do this probably a lot better than that effect, but for free, that's pretty good. If you want to see some other methods, do check out the links in the description to this video and also watch some more videos that come up in the suggestions after this video. Hope you've enjoyed it and do post your questions down below. Check out my Audacity Ultimate Course for Beginners. If you are a podcaster, YouTuber, voiceover artist, or audio editor, you need this course. Head over to mrc.fm slash audacity. That is mrc.fm slash audacity. Thumbs up. Subscribe for more. Music Radio Creative. Dot com